Liz and Samantha, since this summer, legal observers have suggested that it would be an uphill climb legally to charge that father of that Highland Park shooting suspect. But today, the Lake County State's attorney made it clear that he thought that father's actions in 2019 were indeed criminal. Robert Cremo Jr., the father of Robert Cremo III, has been charged with seven felony counts of reckless conduct, one count for each person killed during the July 4th parade in Highland Park. The elder Cremo scheduled to appear in bond court tomorrow. He surrendered himself to authorities today. For months, that father has said he did nothing wrong when he sponsored his then 19-year-old son's under-21 Foyd card application in December 2019, but he did so months after his son allegedly made threats to family members and allegedly threatened to kill him himself on multiple occasions. That Foyd card was approved and later renewed when Cremo the third turned 21 because Illinois State Police said there wasn't enough evidence to deny the application. But today the Lake County State's Attorney said that process depends on parents and guardians doing the right thing. He knew what he knew and he signed the form anyway. This was criminally reckless and a contributing cause to the bodily harm suffered by the victims on July 4th. The older Cremo has retained an attorney who today called these charges baseless, unprecedented, and absurd. And he said that the charges should be alarming to any parents. Over the past several months, he has argued that his client did nothing wrong, simply allowed his son to be vetted for a gun license by the state's established process. If convicted, the elder Cremo could face up to three years behind bars.